Hey guys, how are you all? In this video, I'll be talking about how to find the volume of an isolated footing. Alright, so uh, I got a typical diagram of uh, an isolated footing. So this is the plan, and if we cut the, uh, you know, this diagram at the middle, we get the section uh, as shown here. Alright, so uh, the length of this footing is L. So this is the L, and uh, breadth of this footing is B. Alright, so uh, if we, so at this section, you can see uh, the depth you know the depth at the edge is uh, d is small d and the overall depth of this spring is capital d Alright, so for finding the volume of uh, you know this trapezoidal footing, we're gonna divide uh, this uh, footing into two regions. The uh, the lower one I have highlighted with the blue color, and the upper region I have highlighted with the red color. Alright, so uh, the lower is the volume of lower region is V1, while the volume of upper region is uh, V2. Okay, so uh, what we do is that we find a volume separately, V1 and V2 separately, and we add them, and we get the volume of the entire footing. Alright, so Okay. Okay, so so let us assume that L is a uh, 4 meter and uh, V is a uh, 3 meter. And uh, so this L is uh, 4 meter and uh, this breadth B is 3 meter. And a uh, small L that is uh, so this is the size of a uh, column pedestal. So a small L is a uh, 2 meter and a small B that is this length is uh, 1.5 meter. So depth at the edge so this small D uh, it is 0 0.20 meter and and uh, capital D that is overall depth of this footing is 0 0.80 meter alright so let us first find a uh, volume V1 so volume V1 is nothing uh, but uh, L into V into D that is uh, this length multiplied by uh, this length times this height so if we do that we're gonna find uh, the volume of uh, this rectangular region right so L into B into D so that is 4 into 3 into 0 0.20 and we get V1 as 2.4 meter cube now we find volume V2 so volume V2 is the volume of this trapezoidal region alright so uh, for finding the volume V2 we had to first find this height H right so we have to find this height h so this height h is given by d minus uh, small d capital d minus small d so capital d this height minus this height if we do we will find uh, this height right okay so a1 that is area of this lower plane uh, is l into b because uh, this area is equal to this area and its length and breadth uh, we know so that is uh, f uh, 4 into 3 so this area is uh, 4 into 3 is 12 meter cube alright so a2 the area of this upper pedestal column pedestal is given by l into b that is small l into small B so it's 2 into 1.5 uh, we get it as 3.3 meter square all right so volume V2 uh, you know the volume of this trapezoidal region is given by this formula that is H by 3 so this height divided by 3 times E1 the area of this lower plane plus area of the upper plane uh, plus square root of A1 times A2 so if we simplify this we get the volume V2 as 4.2 meter cube now we add so to find the total volume V, we add V1 and V2. So that is V1 we got as what 2.4 meter cube and V2 as 4.2 meter cube. So we get uh, total volume V as 6.6 .6 meter cube. So this is how you find a uh, volume of an isolated footing. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you.